hey guys it's your girl crystal welcome back to my youtube channel i'm sorry about like my blind um in the background um with like the wetness on it um we were painting and we're redoing the whole entire house if y'all saw my house right now you guys would probably be like girl like get it together but we actually just finished painting um the wall gray which you know what i'll show you guys so you guys are like <laughs> but my house right now is really really torn up i need to do a cleaning video with you guys but oh i love this rug i just bought um i don't know if you guys are gonna be able to see the wall but i actually just finished painting like the wall back they say hi um i just finished painting the wall and um we're re we're really doing like a lot to our apartment because um we're doing a lot y'all let me sit down and talk to y'all because it's been like a second before i kind of came on here that's like the kids room in the back all right so make a real long story short right now we live on long island and in new york and it's very very expensive as i'm sure a lot of you guys unless you have like some real money so we live in a two bedroom yes there are five of us but i have a baby a newborn baby not a newborn but he's one i have a seven and a four year old and um the goal is for us now to like move um upstate to greece to the like the rochester area but we're not 100 percent set on rochester yet so in the meantime, we have to be here for like another like year or two. Um, it's nothing that we really wanted to do, but because the coronavirus kind of hit, we had to kind of like go into our savings and kind of touch money we weren't supposed to really be touching because of the situation. And I forgot to tell you guys, it's your girl Crystal, and this is the Long Island Life, the Davis family. Yes, one hand is painted, one hand is not painted. <sighs> It's been so much going around here, y'all. So much. So, because of that, we decided to remodel and kind of like fix the place up the best way we know how to right now. And that's what we did. So, we're working with what we have. We have a roof over our heads. That's the important part. My kids have clean clothes. My kids have food in the fridge. My kids are ha happy and healthy. Yeah, we don't have a mansion right now. And then like a big, you know, um you know house like a lot of youtubers have but that's okay like we're okay here our kids are still young and like i said we were not expecting to tap into money that we kind of saved for a rainy day and for us to eventually get to where we needed to get to so it's okay though it's okay right okay but anyway i will definitely be coming to y'all with a cleaning video because y'all y'all saw my house right now y'all be like oh my gosh it's not that it's dirty it has like i said we were remodeling so we have to put furniture together we have to really like scrub everything down um i'm actually looking for an accent chair and we're looking for something but we're not really like sure yet what we're looking for when it comes to the living room area so i will keep guys keep you guys updated on that as well but i do have a dollar tree haul for y'all i do and I don't want to talk your ear off anymore. So let's jump into the Dallas Street Hall. And like I said, thank you um, for, you know, just kind of bearing with me right now while we're going through this transition. I love you guys. I love, love, love you guys. All right. So let's see what I found at Dollar Street today, y'all. Not that I needed anything from Dollar Street, but I had to go and check things out. I also stopped the Target today, but I had already unpacked a lot of that stuff, so that's why I didn't did a I didn't do a haul. So today they had these new mugs in y'all for Father's Day, and it says best dad ever. Look how cute these are. It is like a beer mug, so I wanted to put this with like his favorite beer. Um, my husband um used to be like um a beer drinker and stuff but lately he's more like wine and wine coolers so i don't really know if he like is even gonna really like, use like a glass for this for his beer but i saw this shout and i was like yes so i picked that up for daddy's day then i picked up these new potato 
sticks. I don't know if you guys have ever tried these, but these are real baked potatoes. Cheddar cheese, sour cream flavored with bacon and a crispy golden um, coating, y'all. And I found these today. These are part of the appetizers. I've never eaten any of the appetizers from Dollar Tree. So let me know down in the comments if you guys have. And let me know what you guys do think of these. But I did pick these up instead of the pizza rolls today because I'm like so tired. I know my kids love to eat those. But I want to switch it up because I feel like, you know, I'm changing for a healthier, like, diet. Um, you know, I'm doing um, the exercise now. Like, I'm, like, on, like, this new health kick. So, I was really trying to, like, kind of, like, switch things off. And um, they're not, like, totally bad. This is actually for one package, 330 calories. Um, there's not much sugar. Um, but there is like a lot of sodium and cholesterol, so these are not like the healthiest. But like I said, I just kind of wanted to switch it up for the kiddos. And let me know if you guys have tried these. So I got two boxes of those today. Then I picked up this flat, this screwdriver set. It says magnetic tips, flat head. So it comes with like a small and like a long flat head. So I picked this up today because, um... Well, really, I just needed to pop open some paint cans and to fix a couple of things. And when I went to go paint the other day, I realized I didn't have a flathead screwdriver. Why? I'm not sure because I have every other tool except a flathead. So when I seen this today, I was like, girl, you better pick one up just in case. So I picked one up from the Dollar Tree. I don't know how good it's going to be, but that's what I did. I picked up more of this Aromatherapy Slumber um body wash and foaming wash y'all yes y'all your girl is obsessed with this and let me tell y'all something if anything buy this from the dollar tree take y'all light some candles put yourself a nice little bubble bath and get to it y'all get to it then um i don't know if you guys all know this but my wedding anniversary this blind behind me is like really really like distracting because like I should have cleaned that before I came on here, but like I said, my house is all, it just needs like a good clean after I brought all this stuff in, y'all. Then I found this, it's called Our Love Story, and uh, first date, wedding date, our song, first home, and they lived happily ever after. My wedding um, anniversary is coming up June 6th, and I hope the hair and the nail salons open um, for that, because girl, 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 I gotta, um, sheesh. Okay, y'all see this, right? Okay. Then, I found this book today. It's called A Year Between Friends, 33,191 Miles Apart, Craft, Recipes, Letters, and Stories. And I had picked this up um, for me and my girlfriend. This was originally $24.95. And it has, like, all different type. Like, it has, like, some recipes in here. That like you guys could share together. Then um, they have like these print napkins that they were making. So I guess it's kind of like a whole year of like. And then they had like. Um, like letters and stuff to each other. So I so this is so cute. This originally went for $24.95. And I got this for a dollar, but like I said, I really wanted to use this with me and my girlfriend because we love stuff like that. Then I have to keep a food journal now because I'm I'm trying to diet and lose weight. And so I picked this up. It's called Hardcore. And basically, I'm just going to be keeping like a food journal of like what I'm eating, how much I'm eating, and showing it to my doctor because I was told to do that for 90 days. So we're going to be doing that. Y'all, when I found these today at the Dollar Tree, I was like, hold up, Crystal. Hold up. Yo, I bought four of these. Look how cute these photo albums are, y'all. How cute are these? And I picked up four of them. And what I'm going to do is, I'm, I picked up four of these. And I'm going to, I have four kids. So I'm going to make them each like their own individual like book with like um, sonograms and just like a picture with me and their dad and just kind of making them like this memory book 
because and then look how cute this is with like the marble and the black oh this looks so nice y'all so when i found those today i was like girl get them so i did then in this bag over here okay so these are the other three photo albums like i said check these out these were all the way at the bottom of the frame section then my daughter my seven year old she wants to dye her hair and do something different to it so um i told her we could i got this temporary hair color and i also got this semi-permanent hair color now this really is for more like bleach or blonde hair and my girls are brunettes both of them so i don't know how well this is going to work on them but she's seven she just kind of wanted to have fun we're in quarantine still we're still in the house so she was like mom can i get this so i let her get it today then y'all y'all know how i feel about my scrunchies right y'all so i saw these two scrunchies today I was like, yes, girl. I can't wait to straighten my hair and wear my scrunchies. I love scrunchies, y'all. I don't know what it is, but I absolutely 100% love these scrunchies. So I got those. Then my daughter picked this out. She wanted to um, paint this and put this up in her room. It's just like a little flower or whatever. So she likes to decorate her room with stuff she makes. I love it because it's cheap decor. And she just likes to personalize her room. So she's probably just going to paint it or put stickers. Whatever she wants to do. And I'll hang it up for her. Then I found these two sheets of letters today. Because I'm going to be making my frames for my son. I picked up these two baby frames. And he's my baby prince. So I just kind of wanted to make um, these frames. So I picked these up to make those for them. Then I found this. It's called L'Oreal Paris Summer Express Wash Off Body Makeup Lotion. And this is supposed to um, give you like even look streak free, even looking bronze skin tone, all day hydration for flawless smooth feeling skin. So this is basically supposed to like even out your skin and I guess kind of cover up any like like problem areas, which I really I mean, my only problem area is right now is really my arms and like my stomach area. So, I, but I figured I would just try it out, let you guys know. Now, this is light to go with my skin. So, I, hopefully, it'll like blend in. I'm not really sure. Maybe I should have gotten like a medium, but I wasn't sure. Then, this was a brand new item too. This is from Crayola, and this is called Art with Edge Fantasy Beast. And there's 30 pages. And I picked this up for myself because I wanted to kind of get back into coloring. And on the back, there's like all like these different like pictures and stuff. So I kind of wanted to just get back into it. And um, I thought that this was super cool. Another name brand item. So I picked that up. Oh, and I have to say thank you to Thrifty Stephanie. If you guys do not know her, go check her out because because of her i was fine i finally picked these up now this is for mixed road colors and white so say if like you put your like everything in the wash like i do sometimes because i'm just lazy and it's just like been a long day i just throw these in and it's supposed to do like color capture washing pads so basically instead of like your reds getting on your white or your orange getting on the way so this is going to capture it and this works well yeah there's only 10 in here and i'm sure you guys do more than 10 loads of laundry like i do a month so i would recommend maybe picking up like three or four boxes depending on how much laundry you do but i only really do laundry once a week um because i don't have a washer and dryer right now in my house i go to a laundry mat so i only do it like once a week and with like the corona and nobody really going out like crazy i'm do i'm able to do it really just once that once a week and every two weeks been doing like rugs and um drapes and blankets you know to to stay really on top of cleans cleansiness then my son he picked this out but it has like a little stain on it i just realized but this is like a bath puppet my four-year-old picked this out he loves stuff like that um for like the bath time then my daughter picked this up for herself um because it has her name on it it's reflections and it has her name destiny on it so it's just like a little book um about like 
um, courage and empathy. So it kind of just has different quotes from like, this is Joseph Purse at Abraham Lincoln. And so it just kind of has like all different Robert Frost, Albert Einstein. So it kind of just has different like phases and stuff. And I thought this would be cute for Harley again. She's one, of, she's my kid that just really likes that kind of stuff. So as long as it doesn't get too much in her room and I go through my kid's room a lot, I let her, you know, have it. Then I got this. It's called LA Color Tattoo Stomp Pen with a flower on it. And I thought this would be so cute. I've never seen this. And this is the first time I've seen this in my store. And this is LA Colors Tattoo Stomp Pen. And it is a flower, y'all. So go check that out. Then I got some more of the squeeze applicator bottles because I do have tons of alcohol in my thing. So I just kind of wanted to um, put some alcohol in these because I'm still not able to find hand sanitizer like that. So I picked some of these up. Then the last thing I picked up, I picked up one of these April bath and shower scented lotions last time. I picked up two of these. This is the third one. And... Oh, yeah. This has more of like a flowery, oops, flowery type of scent to it. It's not bad. Um, but it's not bad at all, y'all. It's not bad at all. I should really do a video because I have tons of Victoria's Secret lotions. And they seem to feel the same as the dollar lotions. So I've been kind of like asking myself, am I spending like $16 on a bottle of lotion when it's like a dollar value you know what i'm trying to say y'all so i'm not sure but that was the last thing that i picked up so let me know in the comments below what did you guys think about my dollar tree haul i'm super super excited i was able to show you guys my products um and like i said i kind of just wanted to do a little venting at the beginning because i'm sure you guys don't know everything that's been going on um hopefully i can do another macari app haul um if you guys are not familiar go check out my macari app videos and make sure you guys come back and check me out. I love you, Mom. Love, love, love y'all. And maybe I should do a cleaning video. I haven't done one. Um, I did one, and I kind of did, like, a basic type of cleaning for y'all. I should do, like, a whole clean, clean with me type of video and do more, like, um, homemaking stuff on my channel. So, we'll see. Um, like I said, my life, and my, my life and my family gets, like, a little hectic. So, you say hi. That's my son. <laughs> Alright, moms. I will talk to you guys later. Hope you guys are still staying home, staying safe. And if you guys stay if you guys still do have bye to go out, bye. say bye. If you guys still if you guys do have to go out, make sure you guys are safe. I will talk to you guys later. Bye moms.